I made this lamp with the ESP Home firmware. This is a touch sensor. This lamp is fully operational without Wi-Fi or Home Assistant. The touch sensor has 10 increments. The IR remote controls the whole lamp. There are settings for 2, 3, and 5 lights on at the same time and 4 different increments. And the top changes the light, all 5 lights, in 10 increments just like the touch sensor. There's the D1 Mini ESP32. There's two buck power supplies. One runs two lights, the other one runs three lights. There's also a buck three, Mini 360 to run the ESP32. Here's the front of the light. Here you can see the ESP32 code at the bottom. I'm going to upload a link to the GitHub for the whole file. There's the sun in the background. There's the touch sensor again. Here I'm showing you the touch sensor and the temp different steps of 10% per step. There's the power transistors, the MPNs, the D1 Mini ESP32. There are the two buck converters. One controls two light, one controls three lights. Here are some of the presets on the IR controller. Generic controller you get off eBay for like $1.50. 44 buttons on the NEC IR remote. That's a solar flare in the background on our sun. You see in the background the white lights are NeoPixels. Here I'm changing the NeoPixels with the remote. And there's a bunch of presets in there. This whole light doesn't need Wi-Fi at all to work. To power this light, I got an old laptop power supply from the thrift store. I used the laptop power supply to power the three buck converters. The background video I'm playing is a NASA video. Five years of solar flip. This is the light at night time. You can see the accent LEDs. different patterns. 